Well, I'm on Facts of Mars. By now, most of you have heard about this the Sunspot Solar Observatory being closed uh, in New Mexico. And I'm going to jump in this fray because I'm getting angrier and angrier by the day. An observatory in the mountains of southern New Mexico that is dedicated to unlocking the mysteries of the sun has found itself the center of a mystery that is creating a buzz here on Earth. Authorities remain tight-lipped Friday, saying only that an undisclosed security concern was behind the decision to abruptly vacate and lock up the remote facility on September 6th. That is a lie. Uh, they've seen something, folks. There's no question. Something they don't want us to know about. Now, I'm going to say something that's going to sound a little funny. Okay, uh, we need to get cameras focused on the area that it was looking at. And I know you're going to say the sun. Well, maybe it was, maybe it wasn't focused right on the sun. We don't know. Be a good place to start. Sunspot Solar Observatory has been closed for more than a week. The FBI referred all questions to the group and manages the site, the Association of Universities for Research and Astronomy. Officials there say they've been working with the authorities. I would say they most certainly have. So what's the point of going to them? They're just going to give you a line of BS. Association sent an update Friday and has decided that the observatory will remain closed until further notice due to an ongoing security concern. The rest of the National Solar Observatory facilities remain open and are operating normally. Vagueness continued to fuel speculation on social media. What do you expect us to do? We're given, being given no information. This thing's been closed for a week. What do you expect us to do? Well, just shut up and uh, you don't have to know about this. We'll deal with it. No, it's not going to happen. Located in Sacramento Peak, the observatory was established in 1947. It overlooks the Tula Rosa Basin, an expansive desert that includes the city of El Magordo, Holloman Air Force Base, White Sands Missile Range, White Sands National Monument and site of the world's first atomic bomb test. Okay, uh, I'm going to skip the rest of this. What are the possibilities here? Obviously, this thing has seen something that they don't want us to know about. Why other telescopes haven't seen it, whatever it is, I don't know. Three possibilities here. As I see it. If there's something else, then it's something I'm ignorant of. Uh, number one is a killer asteroid heading our way. These are not in order of uh, importance, by the way. Maybe there's a killer asteroid that this thing uh, spotted and it's headed our way. That's one possibility. Another possibility is that the sun is getting ready to do something that's going to be catastrophic for our planet. I'm not just talking about an ordinary solar flare, I'm talking about something big. Like maybe a big shell of gas is ejected or something and hits us. I don't know, use your imagination. Number three. Uh, UFO. Maybe it's saw an alien spacecraft or fleet of them heading our way and they don't want the public to know about it. There you go, you can take your pick. I mean, if there's something else that I don't know about, then... You know, I don't know. I find it very disturbing that this is happening. I'm not satisfied with 
let's turn on going security concerns. I'm not even going to listen to that. That is utter BS. Uh, folks, we need to get some telescopes going. I got one that I haven't used in years. And start looking to see what you can find. They've seen something, and they don't want us to know about it. Whatever it is, it's bad. Real bad. I'm Artifacts of Mars. I approve this message. Here you go again, falling off the wagon. Thanks for watching, but this is important.